What's up everyone and welcome or welcome back to my channel Chess Doctor here with yet another banger and in today's video we are continuing to play some more rapid guys I'm enjoying this journey I'm feeling great because I'm just beating everyone in rapid and I have just unlocked a new talent in chess which is playing rapid chess and I have always always be, uh, been like I can't play rapid on camera it turns out I can you can do whatever you want as long as you believe that you can okay so uh, let's start let's find this victim and let's just crush somebody because this is way too easy yesterday I said way too easy and won so am I gonna do the same today <laughs> we're gonna see 1100 opponent okay chess.com giving me a higher rated opponent this time uh, which is good because if we win we win 10 points but if we lose we lose only six so we do not care okay so we are chilling no more 900s let's go okay so we're gonna develop the horse and we're probably gonna play the catalan uh because i enjoy but this is this pawn structure here is it very good for my catalan bishop that's my question today sir that's my question today uh but we're gonna see i'm still gonna try it out i'm gonna give it a chance but i'm still not sure because these pawns how am i gonna get rid of these pawns and be like having a strong bishop maybe later in the end game okay so a lot of the pawns are here light square i mean sir okay so we're gonna develop our bishop and it would be cool to ask this bishop a question because he looks like as if he doesn't have a lot of chances to go to, okay? So, uh, we can do that. We can do that. Okay, so he took this. Uh, we don't care about it. We're just going to go here and that's it. Because uh, we don't care. Because that's the whole point. You, you can take the pawn. I don't care. I don't have to recapture now. I can recapture later. Sir, I, I, I'm fine, okay? <laughs> okay, so the pinning. He do be pinning me. Uh, <laughs> should we just ask a question here but then we have pawns like this i'm like that so we're gonna go here we're gonna go first there and probably exchange like this i mean i guess he's gonna do that i guess he, i just guess he's gonna could do that sir i don't know guys today i'm kind of full of energy okay slav defense modern bishops game what is the bishop doing exactly i don't know but he's gaming the bishop is gaming, okay? So we're gaming bishops today. Okay. I don't care. I feel like moving my horse, but first I'm gonna castle up. Uh, because I don't care, okay? I, I, I still don't care. Whatever you do, sir, do what you wanna do. I'm fine with all of it, okay? Because here I'm playing a higher rated opponent. So I feel like, hmm... I shouldn't do too much risky stuff. I should just let him play and make a mistake because he's higher rated, but he's still 1000. So I don't care. I do not care, sir. I do not care. So the queen kind of can't be developed, uh, which is unfortunate. So we're going to go like this. And as this bishop bishop that's gaming, uh, the, the question, okay. And now we're going to take with the bishop. Or should we? Maybe we should just take with the pawn. But then the bishop can only go this way. So we, we're probably going to take with the bishop so that we have vision both here and here. But we're staring at our own pawn here, which is... Eh, you know, I'm not, I'm not the, the biggest fan of this variation. <laughs> but it's fine. So we should develop the queen. Should we develop her like this? Just simply ask the question and that's it trade the pieces because he can't do the trick now because i have bishop there even if i had a pawn it would probably be the same no it wouldn't because i wouldn't be able to go b3 i'm just having a lot of thoughts now because i'm drinking a coffee at like 9 p.m guys so uh, <laughs> i wanted to say uh his this bishop is not letting uh, letting him do the like i'm gonna push the pawn i hate when people do that so i'm actually very pleased with this but he can do this he can do this part so should we just go here and like this and like that and uh, you know we don't care we're just uh, we're chilling down a pawn but as i said in the last video you lose a pawn you don't care okay now he gonna push oh opponent you are so annoying this opponent is so annoying okay 
Yeah, we're going to go here, but I feel like he's gonna push this once more and there's just... I can't go here then. I'm gonna go here and look at this side, okay? The pawns are very weird, but he's spending a lot of time pushing his queen side pawns. He's still not castled. He's still not castled. We should definitely try to punish that part. We should definitely try to do that. We can maybe later take this, but maybe he gonna exchange. If he exchanges, we just take like this. And I would actually like that because the board would open up and my bishops and things would finally, you know, work <laughs> and have potentialis. But here, he's just pushing the pawns. Sir, how many pawns can you push? Okay, they're just so annoying. So he got to 1100 elo just by pushing pawns. Okay, sir. Okay. You know what? You do you. I'm going to do me. I'm going to go bishop here. My structure here is looking marvelous. He's still not castled. Yet once again, he's still not castled, okay? So, uh, my, my left palm is itching. Didn't he just give the bishop? Thank you. Or did I mess something up? I, I'm confused. Go! <laughs> 10 points! I'm a winner of 10 points! I beat the higher rated. See, chess is very easy when you're in this rating at least because uh, people just give it to you. I could have been like, <laughs> oh my goodness, you know, he's a 100 elo points above me. Not even that much. But I could have been like, oh, you know, he's a higher rated. I could have been scared. But I wasn't. I was so fearless. I was like, what are you doing, sir? He gave the bishop. He he thought he was smart. He gave the bishop. Okay. So let's go for the game review because we probably have the higher accuracy. Ha ha. Ha ha ha. <laughs> I'm just laughing here at my opponent because 76 straight up. That's good. That's okay. 72.7 for the opponent. He has one great move. Which is this. Yeah, pushing the, these pawns was very annoying. Let's look at the game quickly. He also has one blunder, which was just giving the bishop. Maybe it was a mouse slip, but... Ah, okay. Good. Okay. We don't care here. Yeah, we here exchanged. I, I, I just couldn't do anything else. This was good. Yeah, this was a mistake. Uh, let's see what's the best move here. Because... Oh, we should have just taken. Yeah, because if we take... Uh, we don't care then because we are initiating, like, we are opening up the position. I should have just taken, because if if I didn't, which was this, then he has this great move, which is b4. And he just kicks my bishop, and I have to be very careful. Because, uh, like, if I went here, he goes here, and then I, like, have to be here. Here I was already here, but, you know, oh my goodness, wait, what happened? Okay, so we went this, this was a great move, and then we have this, Okay. He just gave it. He just gave it. 1200 for your chess doctor and uh, 100, uh, 1150 <laughs> for the opponent. Okay. So this game was easy. Uh, this game was very simple. I mean, I just beat a higher rated person like this. So guys, this is a motivational video once again from your chess doctor to you. Directly speaking to you, viewer. Uh, whoever is watching this video, I know that you probably, like a lot of people who are beginners especially and watch my content and just play chess, be like, oh my goodness, like you, you stumble across a high rated person and you feel like you don't know how to play chess anymore, okay? I've been there, I've done that, I know that, okay? But here we proved it. Just, it's all about the mentality. You have to be prepared. You have to be prepared. You have to be like... What you gonna do, sir? What you gonna do? And then he gonna do nothing. Then he gonna give it to you, okay? So just, just be confident, believe in yourself, and don't look at these numbers and be like, oh, that means that he plays a better chess than me. No, you play better chess than him. Just believe in it and it's gonna happen, okay? So just relax, you know? Because uh, I know that these numbers can be very confusing. Like, if I got like a 1200 opponent uh, and... I'm 1000 and then be like, oh, you know, so scary. No, not scary at all. These people are useless. <laughs> okay, I shouldn't be offending my opponent so much, but like they're also intermediate players or beginners or whatever your rating is. They're in the same rating. So you have nothing to be afraid of. Even if it's like 50 points above you, who cares? 
Who cares about the number on the screen, okay? Who cares? So don't be afraid of the high-rated opponent. You can beat them because if I could, you could do it as well, sir, okay? I'm gonna take a coffee break. Buy me a coffee the console stop as a petty, guys, because I have to plug that in. And I have to now say the outro. So thank you for stopping by. Thank you so much uh, for taking your precious time out of your day to watch me. That's ridiculous. Thank you. And uh, if you enjoyed this video and this game, <laughs> make sure to give this video a big thumbs up. Sub to this channel if you aren't already. And leave some wonderful comments. The comments do be cooking. The comment section is amazing. Thank you, guys. And I really enjoy it. And uh, that's just it. Check out the description. Join the Discord. We want you in the Discord. And stay tuned for new arena because it's probably going to happen very soon. I'm going to make a poll. So be ready to vote. You know, be ready to vote. And just believe in yourself, guys. You can do it. You can do it. Okay. So 1100 is not a scary elo. When I look at it right now, I can definitely be higher, a uh, higher rate than that. Okay. So guys, have a wonderful day. Thank you for stopping by. And that's it from your chess doctor. See you tomorrow in a new video. Bye-bye.